Welcome to Wonderslate. Subscribe to our Telegram channel given in the description to updates and study materials. Topic for today's quiz is Sound. Question number 1. In humans, sound is produced by underscore. Option A. Voice box. Option B. Music box. Option C. Jukebox. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is Option A. Voice box. In humans, sound is produced by voice box or larynx. Question number 2. Name the form of energy that is produced by producing vibration in an object. Option A. Wave. Option B. Sound. Option C. Heat. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is Option B. Sound. Sound energy is produced when an object vibrates. The sound vibrations cause waves of pressure that travel through a medium, such as air, water, wood, or metal. Sound energy is a form of mechanical energy. Question number 3. Underscore cannot move through vacuum. Option A. Wave. Option B. Sound. Option C. Heat. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is. Option B. Sound. Sound cannot travel through a vacuum. A vacuum is an area without any air, like space. So sound cannot travel through space because there is no matter for the vibrations to work in. Question number 4. Sound waves are underscore waves. Option A. Longitudinal waves. Option B. Transverse waves. Option C. Both A and B. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is. Option A. Longitudinal waves. Longitudinal waves are always characterized by particle motion being parallel to wave motion. A sound wave traveling through air is a classic example of a longitudinal wave. Question number 5. Underscore is measure of number of oscillations per second. Option A. Time period. Option B. Hertz. Option C. Frequency. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is. Option C. Frequency. Frequency is measure of number of oscillations per second. Question number 6. Frequency is measured in underscore. Option A. Coulomb. Option B. Hertz. Option C. Decibel. Option D. Candela. The correct answer is. Option B. Hertz. Question number 7. Loudness of sound is measured in underscore. Option A. Coulomb. Option B. Hertz. Option C. Decibel. Option D. Candela. The correct answer is. Option C. Decibel. Loudness of sound is measured in decibels. Decibel. Question number 8. Higher frequency gives underscore pitch. Option A. Higher. Option B. Lower. Option C. Medium. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is. Option A. Higher. Higher frequency gives higher pitch. Question number 9. Higher amplitude gives underscore sound. Option A. Smaller. Option B. Louder. Option C. Unchanged. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is. Option B. Louder. Higher amplitude gives louder sound. Question number 10. 
What is the frequency range of audible sound? Option A. 40 to 40,000 Hertz. Option B. 60 to 60,000 Hertz. Option C. 80 to 80,000 Hertz. Option D. 20 to 20,000 Hertz. The correct answer is Option D. 20 to 20,000 Hertz. The frequency range of audible sound is 20 to 20,000 Hertz. Question number 11. What is unpleasant sound called? Option A. Noise. Option B. Sweet sound. Option C. Both A and B. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is. Option A. Noise. Noise generally has an unpleasant connotation but nothing that implies loudness. It is also a bit vague and can be used as a neutral word as well. Question number 12. Presence of unwanted and excessive sound in the environment produces underscore. Option A. Air pollution. Option B. Water pollution. Option C. Sound pollution. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is Option C. Sound pollution. Presence of unwanted and excessive sound in the environment produces sound pollution. Question number 13. How many parts have human ear? Option A. 2. Option B. 3. Option C. 4. Option D. 1. The correct answer is Option B. 3. The human ear consists of three parts, the outer ear, middle ear and inner ear. T. Question number 14. What is the frequency range of inaudible sound? Option A. Less than 20 Hz. Option B. 20 Hz. Option C. 20 to 20,000 Hz. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is Option A. Less than 20 Hz. Less than 20 Hz is the frequency range of inaudible sound. Question number 15. Sound frequencies which cannot be detected by human ear are called underscore. Option A. Audible frequency. Option B. Inaudible frequency. Option C. Ultra audible frequency. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is Option B. Inaudible frequency. Sound frequencies which cannot be detected by human ear are called inaudible frequency. Question number 16. Sound frequencies which can be detected by human ear are called underscore. Option A. Audible frequency. Option B. Inaudible frequency. Option C. Ultra audible frequency. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is. Option A. Audible frequency. Sound frequencies which cannot be detected by human ear are called audible frequency. Question number 17. The sound which is pleasing for the ear are called underscore. Option A. Lonely sound. Option B. Solo sound. Option C. Echo. Option D. Musical sound. The correct answer is. Option D. Musical sound. Musical sound are pleasing for the ear. Question number 18. Drum vibrates with the underscore frequency so they are called low pitch sound. Option A. High. Option B. Low. Option C. Equal. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is. Option B. Low. Drum vibrates with a low frequency so they are called low pitch sound. Question number 19. 
shape of the outer part of the ear is like underscore. Option A. Funnel. Option B. Elephant ear. Option C. Both of these. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is Option A. Funnel. Question number 20. The repeated motion in which an object repeats the same movement over and over are called underscore. Option A. Oscillatory motion. Option B. Rolling motion. Option C. Static motion. Option D. Sliding motion. The correct answer is Option A. Oscillatory motion. The repeated motion in which an object repeats the same movement over and over are called oscillatory motion. Thank you for watching the video. If you'd like practice this quiz then download the Wonderslate app now. Link in the description below. If you have any suggestion for us feel free to leave comments. If you liked the video and want to see more of it hit the thumbs up and don't forget to click on subscribe button to get more updates of the future videos.